guys, it's Rose with Rose Likes Crochet. How is everybody doing? It is Tuesday, October 26, 2021, and I am coming on here with another update for wings. Uh, for those of you who are new here, my name is Rose. I like to crochet. I like yarn a lot. Um, I've done some shopping lately, don't tell anybody. Um, and I make stitch markers, so please go check out my Etsy shop. Um, there is a sale going on on select stitch markers in there. There. and if you could favorite the shop and favorite some items that really does help me so I live here in the Chicago area I have one daughter her nickname is carrots like the vegetable and we got a bunch of animals in this place that we call it the zoo so this year as well as last year um, we all helped a domestic violence organization that is based here in the Chicago area called wings um, they requested handmade items and they requested specific items every month um, based on their needs and events that were going on with them. So for October, they requested kitchen items like washcloths and dishcloths. And it's almost the end of October. So if you haven't already sent in your items, um, try and find somewhere local to donate them or you know if you don't think it'll take that long to get here then go ahead and send them um for november they're asking for toys for boys and chunky baskets now i have a playlist on my channel it's called wings and there are some tutorials in there for some uh, suggestions for toys for boys as well as chunky baskets. Um, so I think that's basically the gist of it. You can go check out the Wings website and you can also check out all the information in the description box down below. Um, if you want the whole list of what we were um, donating this whole year, uh, you can go back to one of the earlier videos from like April or May. You can also come join our Facebook group. There's only three questions to answer. And the pinned announcement is the entire list for the year for wings. So for this video, I actually have 19 packages and I'm gonna try to do this in one video. <laughs> See if um, I, I'm able to upload um, the video to YouTube like this. If you're seeing this, then it worked. Um, so I think that's it for introductions. Just so you guys know what I'm wearing. Um, it is my merch, I don't know, I guess. it's. <laughs> I say this expression a lot, shut the front door when I get excited. So I'm wearing my hoodie. Um, it's We're in Chicago here and it just rained for like a day and a half straight and it's kind of chilly. So <laughs> I'm wearing a sweatshirt today. So, all right, are you guys ready to get started? So like I said, we have 19 packages. Um, I know there were some questions that I've gotten, like how many washcloths have we gotten? And I'm sure it's in the thousands, maybe a couple thousand. I've not been counting. Um, I apologize if anyone wants to know a number, but I'm not gonna have that number. So unless someone else was counting, um, I, don't, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> um, so are you guys ready? So we're just gonna get started. Okay, so this first package came from AJ's personal touch from Indiana and there were some cards in the in the package and by the way if you guys are donating you don't have to put a card in the package um, I know a lot of people um, ask for what patterns are being used and what yarn so if you want to put a note in the box for what patterns you're using or not you don't have to it's totally up to you um, you can just write wings on the package and I'll know what it's for um, most people don't personally send me a gift of washcloths <laughs> or baskets so I'll know what it's for um, the um, mailing address if you want to send a donation is my happy mail address which is down below in the description box and my email is down there as well if you have any questions um, keep in mind I do work full-time and I'm a single mom so please be patient with me if you don't hear from me right away okay um, so here are the cards so the first one says um, sending you a hug and it says rose i really wanted to make more washcloths but my health had other plans i just got the second one done today i will be sending you inspire me so much you help me um do something to oh you help me to decide to start my channel okay so if i can find her aj's personal touch i'll link her down below and then the second card says may you be blessed with strength encouraged to face what lies ahead and it says the first washcloth is orange life is a gourd oh how cute this is by crochetcreations.com and the second washcloth is the blueberry ripple and oh that's really cute too orange slice dishcloth 
on the Premier website by Premier Yarns Design Team. So AJ's Personal Touch, thank you so much for sending the two washcloths and letting us know what the patterns are. That is amazing. And by the way, you guys, um, you, you don't ever have to apologize for not sending enough or for not sending anything. It's really, it's up to you. You don't have, you don't, please don't feel obligated to send anything and please don't apologize for not sending anything. I'm always going to encourage you to donate locally if you can. And you know, if you send one or you send 10, it's all really, really appreciated. Okay, next. So the next package comes all the way from Canada and it is from Chris and she has a YouTube channel here. It is called Garden Yarns. Hi, Chris. And, um, Chris, I don't know if you guys have been with me for a while, you'll know that Chris, um, I commissioned her to make um, some very special washcloths for me. Um, I'm not gonna explain what they are, but if you've watched my channel, you'll know what they are. Um, <laughs> they're just awesome, so she's so talented. <laughs> Thanks again, Chris. Anyway, she sent this card, and the envelope actually matches that. That's so pretty. Okay, and she writes, Hi Rose, here is my donations for wings. Cheers from Christine. Okay, so here is the stack of washcloths. She crochets and she knits. So here is her stack of washcloths. They're beautiful. And because she's in Canada, we have a special... Um, so for this channel, we are doing, or for Wings donations, we're doing thank you gifts. And um, everyone who is in the United States gets entered into one kind of random number picker drawing. And then everyone from Canada, um, from July to the end of the year, will get entered into um, a special random number picker. And Debbie, the Canadian crotcheter, will be sending one person um, a thank you gift. Um, and then for the people in the US, um, I do thank you gifts at the end of every month. So Chris, you are entered into our Canadian thank you prize pool. So thank you so much for sending the washcloths. I really do appreciate it. And you guys go check out her channel. She's, um, she's awesome. I just, I enjoy watching her a lot. Okay, next. The next package comes from Jeannie and she is from um, Idaho and she sent this beautiful card. Oh, I love that. And she writes, Hi, Rose, Carrots, and the Zoo. Here is my October donation of 15 washcloths. They are all different sizes and patterns. Been busy working on flying discs and dinosaur amigurumis for November. Thanks for all you all you and our fellow crafters do, and you are welcome for what I did. Thank you. Blessed be Arizona Genie. P.S. I'm excited to get the crochet planner book from September. Thank you, Token. Thanks again from Jeannie. So Jeannie um, won one of the uh, crochet planners from uh, Laura at Crojo Corner. So um, that was like a special custom order that she had to do. Anyway, here are the washcloths. Oh my gosh, Jeannie, thank you so much. That is so awesome. Look at this huge stack, you guys. So for those of you who are counting, that's a lot, okay? <laughs> All right, so thank you so much, Jeannie, for sending. I think Jeannie has contributed every month for the entire year already. So thank you so much, Jeannie. All right, next. So the next package comes from one of my good dear friends. Her name is Becky, and she's from Louisiana. And she sent this beautiful card. Hi, Becky. And she writes, hi, Rose, a little late getting out, so hoping they make it in time. I had every intention of making more of them, but just didn't get it done. Hope they're okay. You're the bomb diggity from Becky. All right, so Becky is a towel topper genius here, and she made some of these beautiful towel toppers. I love the brightly colored towels that you used. Oh my gosh, they are so pretty. And then here is a Christmas one. Oh, Becky, thank you so much. And no, like I said, no need to apologize for only doing one or doing none. It's really not a problem at all. I do appreciate anything that anyone sends in. Okay, next. So the next package comes from Esther and she is from Texas and she sent this beautiful card and she writes, Rose, thank you for taking your time and collecting all these amazing creations. I enjoy watching and get ideas on what to make. Take care and have a wonderful holiday season from Esther. Okay, so Esther sent in like two bags of these towel toppers and I just have to show you because I love the towels. They're absolutely adorable. So there's flamingos and 
Paisley's. Oh, and by the way, she sent a big bag of chocolates to me. Thank you so much, Esther. It's been cold enough here for if anyone wants to send chocolate, um, it probably won't melt now. So there's two there. <laughs> you guys don't have to send me chocolate. <laughs> and then there's two there. Oh my gosh, these are just so pretty. Hello Fall and a blue one. And here we go. Here are some fruits lemons oh my gosh these are so pretty i love the way she matched up the color of the towel topper to something on the towel those are amazing and then here is another one so esther thank you so so much for sending all these amazing towel toppers they are awesome i love the colors the patterns the towels everything that you chose i really do appreciate it um also wanted to just let you guys know that i've had quite a few people ask if they can see where these donations are going and unfortunately for safety and security reasons um that's not going to be possible so um um, I do appreciate everyone making the donations and rest assured your donations are going to people who need them. Um, but for security reasons, they can't be shown. Okay, all right, next. Okay, so the next bag comes from someone from Texas and um, there's no first name and there's no card. So I'm pretty sure um, whoever sent this, I wanna just tell you that I really, really do appreciate it. Um, I don't really wanna say their last name. I know I've done this before, but this is an interesting last name and I don't want anyone to be able to figure it out so um, it's not like Smith or anything but um, anyway here is the stack of washcloths that you sent and I want to say I appreciate it so much they're all so soft and the patterns are so pretty and there is one that I wanted to show you guys because I just love the color combination Oh my goodness. So you know who you are from Texas. I want to say thank you so much for sending the bag of washcloths. And thank you everyone who has been donating. Um, you know, you guys spend your time and your yarn and then your money to ship it here to people that you don't know and you'll never know. And it's very, very much appreciated. Charity really does feel good. Okay, next. The next package comes from Nicole and she is from Michigan and I love Nicole's cards. She always sends these little cats with the purple hats on them. I just love them. And let's see what she writes. Hi Rose, October has been a rough month for me and I was worried I wouldn't get any washcloths, dishcloths finished. Thankfully, I managed a few. I also made a quick little ornament for Crystal. Thanks again for all you do. I love watching your videos. All the best to you, Carrots and the Zoo from Nicole. So um, for those of you who are new here, there is only a couple days left, but I am collecting ornaments for Crystal at Bag o Day for her Christmas tree because she just bought a new house and is going to have a 12 foot Christmas tree. So um, when we started this, um, she was not giving out her address, but now she is. So you can still send them to me up until November 1st. Okay, so let's see the washcloths first. So um, you said this is just a few that you got done. Okay, <laughs> Nicole. All right, so here is a stack of washcloths. Yeah, just a few. I think you did pretty darn good. And then these were tied together. So this is a washcloth and then two hot pads. And look at the cool designs that made. That is so cool. And then here is, oh, it's a Christmas tree. There is a Christmas tree for Crystal's Christmas tree. <laughs> cool is that? So Nicole, thank you so much for sending the ornament and especially thank you so much for sending um, the washcloths for wings. I do appreciate it. Okay, next. All right, you guys, the next box came from someone that apparently wanted to remain anonymous. There was no return address on the box. There was only a zip code on the label. And I'm not going to tell you what the zip code is, but for whoever you are who sent these, you know who you are. I want to say thank you so much there is this huge stack of dishcloths. So there's one big stack. These are some extra big ones right here. So there's one stack. And then here is another stack right here. And then there's more. <laughs> Wait, and there's more. So all of these washcloths came in this box and there is no name or anything on it. So I, I don't know who to thank, but whoever you are, I do appreciate you sending these washcloths and I hope you understand that these will go for um, a very, very good cause and I do appreciate it. Okay, next. 
The next package comes from Stacy, and she's from Michigan, and she sent this adorable card. And she writes, hi Rose, I love crocheting washcloths, dishcloths. So this, so was happy to hear from Jennifer Cinnamon Stitches, Ella at No Catchy Name, and Crystal at Bag O'Day that you were donating them to Wings in October. I really enjoyed making them. Thank you so much for hooking them up with those who need them. Kind regards from Stacy. Well, Stacy, I'm glad that, um, if you guys don't know, I harassed, I mean, asked a bunch of podcasters <laughs> to help me get the word out that we needed washcloths for wings. And so I do appreciate everyone who um, said on their YouTube channel to send washcloths over here for wings because I think we um, broke any records that we were trying, although we weren't trying to break any records. So here is the stack of washcloths. They're so beautiful and they're like perfectly made. And I absolutely love, love, love the design on them and the colors and they're just gorgeous so Stacy thank you so much for sending all of these amazing amazing washcloths I really do appreciate it um also just so you guys know um in the last update video there was a washcloth that was so so pretty and I was like oh my god I would love to know what that pattern was um so believe it or not I got an email yesterday or the day before from Glenda at the creative grandma hi Glenda and she said um she knew which pattern that was that I was asking about and it was one of hers so um she's actually sent me the written pattern so if I can find that I will put the link um if she has a video tutorial which she probably Probably does I'll put the link down in the description box so thank you so much Glenda for letting me know what that pattern was it's awesome she has amazing patterns by the way but Stacy thank you so much for these washcloths I appreciate it okay next so the next box comes from Sharon and she's from Texas and there was no note that I could find in the in the package but there were these beautiful washcloths on the top and I'm going to show you what's underneath um, in in the bottom of the box here but check that out aren't they so pretty oh my gosh they're all purple I love them okay so this is what I saw when I took those off the top of the box oh my gosh don't those look gorgeous so I'm gonna leave them in the box like this for wings um so they can check out how nicely everyone is packaging and you guys don't have to package anything nicely you can just toss them in an envelope that's fine um but thank you so so much Sharon for sending these I do appreciate it I love the way you put them in the box and I know that the ladies and gentlemen at Wings are going to get really really good use out of all of the washcloths and dishcloths that you guys have sent Okay, next. The next box comes from Bianca and she's from California. And I did not see a note in the box, which is fine. Um, but I do apologize for anyone who says they send a note and I don't see it. Oh, I'm so sorry. Okay, so anyway, here is the stack of washcloths that Bianca sent. They are beautiful. I love, love, love the colors. And check out, the, this is like an extra, like a, like a long one. And look at the pattern on that. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. Bianca, if you could like leave a comment and let us know what pattern that is because that's gorgeous. I just love that. Um, and I do appreciate you sending this all the way from California. I know shipping is really high these days, you guys. So I do appreciate you guys sending in. Okay, next. All right, you guys, the next box also came from Canada from Mary Rose. Hi, Mary. And she sent this card and you'll see why I'm smiling in a second. And by the way, you guys, I'm always so excited to see everything that comes out of the boxes, even if it's washcloths. It's just so cool to like, I don't have anyone that crochets around me. I mean, yeah, there's Lori Lulu and there's um, Sandy from Hook Hook Crochet and there's Kit from All Things Crochet in it with Kit, but they're still pretty far away from me. I mean, they're like an hour away. So it's not like I can go hang out with them and crochet. So I don't get to see other people's crocheted stuff. So for me, it's really, really exciting when I open up all these boxes to see all of your handiwork and it's all absolutely beautiful. Okay, so anyway, Mary sent this card, just a little note. Oh my gosh. Okay, hi Rose, I hope this note finds you well. October washcloths and November boy toys are included. I have sent the Christmas ornament for Crystal in a separate package but mailed it on the same day. 
Mary, I have the Christmas ornament. Thanks again for all you do to coordinate all this mail deliveries, unboxing, recording, etc., to make these donations to Wings possible. Looking forward to the next season of giving. Best wishes, Mary Rose. And she is on Instagram if you guys want to go follow her as Mary Makes It All. Okay, so let's see what she sent. She sent in these beautiful washcloths. So there's three, and she tied them nicely and put a butterfly on them so beautiful and then she sent some toys for boys so maybe this will give you guys some ideas oh my gosh it's a football and it's awesome oh my gosh i love it wait wait till you guys see this one. Oh my gosh it's a rocket ship shut the front door shut the front door mary where did you find a pattern for this? Can you please let us know? Because this has to be the cutest little rocket that I have ever seen with a little fire. Oh my gosh. Okay, and then there's this teddy bear. Stop it. You're kidding me, right? Do you guys see this guy? And he's velvet. He's made of velvet. Oh my gosh, you are so super talented, Mary. Oh my gosh, I love that. And then there's a Pokeball. Here's a Pokeball. And there's something in there. Oh, it's Pikachu. Oh my gosh. That is so cute. I'm going to make sure he stays in there. Mary, thank you so much for sending these amazing, amazing toys for November and the washcloths. They're absolutely beautiful. And I really do appreciate it. And please, if you can tell us where you got the pattern for this, even the football and the teddy bear, like, dude, not for me, but other people, because I don't do amigurumi very well. So <laughs> thank you so much, Mary, for sending those. You're amazing. And I do appreciate it. Okay, next. The next package comes from Cheryl, and Cheryl is from Michigan, and she sent this huge bag, which I'm going to leave them all in the bag, but she sent this huge bag of washcloths, and it looks like there's knitted and crocheted ones in here, so check those out. Oh my goodness gracious, how awesome is that? Look at these. What cool designs on the knitted with washcloths. Oh my gosh. I just love them. Wow. Thank you so, so much, Cheryl, for sending this huge bag of washcloths. I really do appreciate it. Um, here I go again. I'm going to start hugging things. <laughs> you guys, in the last update, there was a someone sent a huge bag of washcloths and I had to hug it. So I'm really sorry if that bothers you, but I couldn't help myself. And now I'm hugging this one. So we better hurry up and get to the next package, okay? <laughs> The next package comes from Susan and she's from Kentucky and I have a note here and it says, uh, Dear Rose, thank you for all you do. You have no idea how much your videos help people. I have watched you and a few others for several years now. I lost my mama in February this year and watching videos by you, Cinnamon Stitches, No Catchy Name, and a few others has helped me get through some very rough times. Thank you to everyone who donates to Wings. Lots of love, hugs, and prayers. Susie, your Yarny sister from southeastern Kentucky. Well, Susan, I'm so sorry to hear about your mama. I, I'm, my heart is going out to you for sure. So, um, but Susan sent these amazing, amazing towel toppers. And you guys, everything she sent is white. And that is, I don't know, I think that is just so clean looking. I love all the other stuff, but look at how clean looking this is. So the, the crochet part is white and the towel is white too. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, six of the towel toppers. And then she sent this huge stack of washcloths and they're all white. Oh my goodness. And they're beautiful and they're soft. <laughs> Susan, thank you so much for sending in all of these items, and I hope that you find some time to heal your heart a little bit. And um, and I'm glad that you can watch people on YouTube or whatever, and that we can maybe boost your spirits a little bit. So um, you just you can all let us know if we ever can do anything else for you. Okay, next. All right, you guys. <laughs> Wait till you see this next box. Okay, so the next box came from one of my favorite people, like, of all times. He's just so cute. I love him. His name is Gary, and he's from Urban Yarn, and he sent me his stuff 
it was wrapped in brown paper, but it's a shoe box. So Gary, now I know exactly what brand of shoe you wear. And it looks like I know what size. And no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Maybe that's your hubbies. Anyway, um, Gary sent this card. Gary, you're so sweet. I just, if you guys don't know Gary, you should. He's, his channel is called Urban Yarn and he crochets, he knits. He's dyed, hand dyed yarn and sent it to me and I used it in a project and it was beautiful. Anyway, go check him out. You will not be disappointed. Okay, he writes, to Rose, Carrots, and the Zoo, a little thank you for all that you do in this yarn community, Rose. You are such a generous and caring person, and we are the lucky ones knowing you. Please find enclosed washcloths for wings, chocolates made in a nut-free facility for carrots, and you. Oh no, Gary, I'm not going to be able to see one of those pieces of chocolate <laughs> and a Christmas ornament you are collecting for Crystal over at Bag O'Day. Much love from Canada, Gary at Urban Yarn. Oh my gosh, Gary, I just love you. Okay, so here is the ornament for Crystal and let's see what it looks like in there. So here's the card for Crystal, Happy Holidays. And it said, oh, there is a lot of words in here. I'm gonna let Crystal read it if that's okay. And then let's see if we can show you what the ornament looks like. You guys, check this out. Oh my gosh. Isn't he cute? It's a little moosey moose. Oh my gosh. Look at his eyes and his nose in the back. It says to Crystal from Gary. Oh my gosh, that is amazing. Um, so also, so you guys know, because not everyone watches the Wings videos, I will have one more update, ornament update for Crystal. So you'll see all the ones that didn't come with Wings stuff and you'll see all the stuff that came with Wings stuff in probably one more video at the end of the month. So, oh my gosh, Gary, that ornament is adorable. I'm sure I'll, I will be showing it again and then I'll be shipping it off to Crystal. Let me show you the washcloth that he sent for wings though. Okay, so this is what was in the shoe box. <laughs> Gary, I just love it, oh my gosh. Okay, so it looks like he used Big Twist yarn because it's got the label in there. So big twist. How did you get it? Did someone send it to you, Gary? Or you guys are getting stuff from Joanne's now. Let me know if you need more cotton, okay? I'll send you some. All right, so then he's got all of these washcloths. So there's one, two, three, four, five. Five washcloths there, oh my gosh. Okay, and then he sent this big, okay, so you guys, my daughter is allergic to peanuts and tree nuts and a couple other things. And she can't even have anything made in a facility with those items. So um, in Canada, they're pretty smart about food allergies and a lot of the stuff that they have there is made in a peanut-free facility. So Gary sent this big box of candy for my daughter. I'm telling you, I'm not gonna see a bit of this. Um, oh my gosh. So this is a big box. Smarties, Arrows, Kit Kats, and Coffee Crisp. Crisp. Coffee crisp. She's probably not going to eat the coffee things, but I won't either. But anyway, Gary sent this big thing of chocolates. And I don't know if you guys can see this, but it says it's peanut free. So she can actually have this stuff. Now in the United States, we have Kit Kats, but she cannot eat them here because they're made in a facility with peanuts. So, oh my goodness. And Smarties, by the way, are like M&Ms, but they're 10 times better. Just so you know, if you guys ever get a chance to, to taste Smarties, <laughs> go get some. <laughs> Gary, thank you so much for sending the candy for my daughter. Oh my gosh. The ornament for Crystal and the washcloths. I really do appreciate you. Okay, next. The next box comes from Renee and she's from California and she sent this card. Oh my gosh, you guys are so sweet. Hello Rose, thank you for all the kind things you do with your page. There are five sets of towel tops included. I did not use a pattern and I had a great time creating the toppers. Your crochet friend Renee, oh my gosh. She's got them all in individual baggies but it looks like there's um, two in each one. So I'm gonna show you guys. That is one of them and the towels are beautiful. Here is another set. Oh my gosh, these are gorgeous. Wow, look at this Christmas one, you guys. Oh my gosh, these are just amazing. Here is, um, oh, it says like home sweet home on there. So, so pretty. And then this one is like a lemon one. It is a lemon one. It's not like one, it is one. 
Wow, Renee, thank you so much for sending these towel sets. They're absolutely beautiful. It's exactly what Wings has requested, and I so appreciate you doing that. Okay, we have three boxes left. So the next box comes from Sean, and Sean is from Michigan, and she sent a thank you card, and I thank you guys. And it says, hi Rose, thank you for all you do. The doll dress and scrunchie are late more for a laugh. <laughs> Okay, please let Pam know I have sent washcloths. Happy holidays from Sean in Michigan. Okay, so Pam at Pamela's Adoring Crochet is doing a contest and Pam is keeping track of that. I'm not keeping track of that. Okay, so here is the scrunchie for a laugh. We were collecting those, I don't know, back in April or something. <laughs> and this is the doll dress that she sent. That's beautiful. I think those were September, I don't remember. Okay, and then we have washcloths. So I'm gonna show you the washcloths that she sent. Look at that star one, how pretty. Oh my goodness, look at that. Oh my gosh, I love that. That is so cool looking and check that one out. Oh my gosh, they're all really cool. <laughs> okay, and then she sent hot pads too. So here are some hot pads. And I have made these before and I used um, the tutorial by um, Margaret Oleander from, I can't remember her channel. She doesn't post that much anymore. But anyway, that's where I got my tutorial from. Um, but thank you for the hot pads. And then she sent an ornament for Crystal. So the card in there just says for Crystal and the Bod family, happy holidays. And here is the ornament. Oh my goodness, it's beautiful. Wow, Sean, I will make sure that she gets this and uh, keep an eye out for the, the last update for ornaments. I'm sure um, this will be shown again on there, but thank you so much. Oh, you know what? Hold on, guys. There's also all of these scrubbies and face scrubbies and kitchen scrubbies in here. Those are all like the um, tool or the nylon scrubbies okay you guys can see them so sean thank you so much for sending this big box of goodies i absolutely love it and i totally totally appreciate it all right two more boxes guys the next package comes from margaret and she's from minnesota and she sent a note and it says dear rose enclosed you will find an ornament for crystal i sent in some wash slash dishcloths earlier but didn't want to waste any space in the box so i made some towels for wings i appreciate your reminders to donate locally and i have started checking with surrounding cities i live in a rural area so the centers are few and far between so far i haven't had any luck finding centers that do something similar to wings they just need cash i totally understand that need anyhow there are still more cities i need to look into so again thank you for reminding us to donate locally if possible best wishes from margaret oh margaret thank you so much for even like trying and and looking and um i know um you know back two years ago we started this not a whole lot of people were accepting donations so i'm we're really blessed that we were able to find an organization that was okay so here are the towel toppers that she sent that's awesome there's a brown one in here and then there's an orange one in here and then she's got this box that says crystals ornament. So let's see if we can see what it is. Okay, so the card is sealed, so I'm not gonna open up the card. And she's got a lot of packing stuff in here, but oh my goodness, I can actually take this out. How beautiful is this, you guys? <gasps> Holy smackerels, that is gorgeous. She is gonna love that. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I'm gonna wrap it back up in the box and you'll see it again in the um, last update for Crystal's ornaments. But Margaret, that's beautiful. Thank you so much for sending that for Crystal. I will make sure that it gets to her safe and sound. Okay, one more box, guys. So the last box comes from Deborah, and she's from Texas and she sent this adorable flamingo card. <laughs> oh my gosh. And that's what happens when you open it up. <laughs> so she says, hi, Rose and Zoo. I have 12 towel toppers using Pamela's Adoring Crochet pattern. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys. Oh my gosh. Look at all of these. That is awesome. So there's one, two, three, four. I'm sure I'm missing some. Five, six. They're awesome. Seven, eight, nine. 10, oh my gosh, so pretty, 11 and 12. So you guys, if you are interested in that pattern, that's from Pamela's Adoring Crochet. She says there are eight 
flower shape dish scrubbies using crystal at bag o days pattern okay so i think that's these so there's one two three four these are so cute five oh my gosh six seven and eight okay and then she says there are 10 round dish scrubbies using glenda at creative grandma's pattern okay so then there's there's three here there's another three. Oh my gosh and then there is four more oh my goodness you guys are machines and then she says there are 11 large round dish scrubbies also a creative grandma pattern okay so that's this stack right here Oh my goodness and nine large square scrubbies from different content creators okay so there are the she says the large square ones and they can be used as washcloth scrubbies dishcloths whatever oh my goodness deborah thank you so much for sending this huge box of goodies um you had a little bit of everything and i do appreciate every time anyone sends anything in and i do want to encourage you guys to leave a positive comment down below i know it seems redundant but it's different people that contribute every time and it would be really nice if they could get a positive comment um i hope you guys aren't getting sick of this because we still have another month i mean not of washcloths we only have like a week left of washcloths but um um, you know, we will be finishing up um, our donation event for our charity event for Wings um, in, in November. So um, any questions, please let me know. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye.